Now that we're getting into programs that you're basically writing from scratch for the web, basing on, I know you're basing it on my work, but it should be completely original, I want you to start debugging your code. Now, when I grade, I use Firefox, and I will go into View Page Source. And you'll notice that there are different colors in Firefox that are giving you different information. Green is comments, orange here, this is special code for non-breaking space, blue is a link or inside of a quote, purple is reserved HTML characters. So I'm going to show you this page, here I'm using Dreamweaver, and I'm going to put in a couple of errors. I'm going to put in an extra slash, I'm going to forget to close my paragraph tag, and you'll notice this may fix break things here. Sometimes Dreamweaver will tell you, sometimes it won't. It depends on the error. And then I'm going to put in a, you get rid of a space that it needs here for the link, and that makes the link go away. Now sometimes you can tell your error right in here or in Aptana by previewing it. But if you were to save it, and then preview in Firefox, Let's try refreshing it. I may have broken it so badly that it doesn't view. It did. I've let, broke it so badly it doesn't view. So I can go into View Page Source, and I can start looking for my errors. And some of them will come up, and some of them won't. Between the two, you can generally catch them all. So here, these are basically Ah, uh, it's because I'm not closing the title, it's not showing me anything. This should have given me a red error in um, Firefox. Let's try fixing that one. And put. Yes, doll, I was just saving it. I can refresh it here. Okay, so that brings it back. Ah, there we go, now the rest is working. Apparently if you break it in the title, nothing else shows up. So this is showing you that the code will turn red if it's an error. And if you hover over it, it'll tell you that there's a missing uh, closing tag immediately before, which is correct, it's correct right here. This one here, when you hover over it, it said an equals when expecting an attribute name. The attribute name is missing. That's because we don't have the space here. So it's going to give you some information about the errors. It's not always helpful unless you know it pretty well, but at least will indicate which line the error is on, and that can be incredibly useful. If you're in Dreamweaver and you click on your line of code in the design view, and I usually work in the split view, so I have my code on this side and the design on the other, then I can go directly to the line where the error is, and I can fix it. And for this one, it's right here. And so I can put my space back in. And then I can save all, put it up on the site, close the code, refresh. You always have to refresh to test it. That looks like it's better. View page source and nothing's red. Ignore the ampersand NBSP, non-breaking spaces, that's orange. It's just a key code for um, anything that we're putting in. You have ones for copyright and things like that. Those will be orange. But I'm going to be looking for red errors. And you want to make sure that you check the same way I do by viewing things in Firefox, because then you won't have points taken off.